morning neighborhood communique we are at the courthouse nice and early that's right i said nice and early it's 7 28 a.m we're never up this early well maybe we are but we're just not out of the house this early well i am not kevin's not he's I, normally still in bed i used to work remember when that yeah, happened yeah but it's been a long time yeah, now yeah, so all right, you haven't right, been right, up right. this early so in I'm a long leave time leave you here at the courtroom <laughs> i'll take you in so let's go get this over with and uh -huh. see if we can uh, get back home and do some work yay yay <laughs> All right, so I'm at my mom's trailer, and she has a door that has fallen off the hinges. And since this is a uh, mobile home, it doesn't have a normal door. It doesn't have normal hinges. This is what we have. And uh, this one's okay. This one has broken off. I think the door jam is uh, broken off as well. It doesn't look like we have any dry rot or anything. Right now, what I want to do is... Um, I'm going to put some glue in there and clamp it together, give it some time to uh, to uh, dry, and in this weather that'll be pretty quickly. Take a look at the door jam on the inside and uh, go from there. And I will probably end up using longer screws, maybe more, uh, doesn't it look like there. I can use more. We'll see what I can do. These are the worst hinges I've ever seen. And I think somebody just built these doors. I don't think they're real. Yeah, because the guy here, he was, he was supposed to do stuff, but he uh, really did a bad job on a lot of stuff. So I may have to come back and replace that. the whole jam because there's, it's really thin and there's not yeah. much holding the, yeah. the, uh, the nails in at all. Because yeah, I put in longer nails and it didn't matter because it went th it's only about three quarters of an inch thick. You can see it's already splitting here. Yeah. 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 So, and I moved this hinge, trying to get away from the, the holes down there, but it just kept splitting. Yeah. So, but it's holding right now. I don't know. Keep and it door, yeah, and it used to, I know, hung off center, so it, yeah, he never so, did a good job. So, this is, uh, perfect. Actually closes. Yeah. So, here we go. Okay, <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. All right, so I just finished up at Mom's putting the door in and basically knocking a couple of nails in that had come loose. These uh, trailers are shake and move and all the nails just start squeaking out. So just knock them in so it would stop catching your clothes. Get back home to uh, Val, who we think is passing at least one stone. She's uh, pretty much asleep right now. And, uh, so maybe I'll get some vlogging done or some editing done for tonight. And I, again, not sure about uh, shout outs because uh, I don't think Val's really available. Uh, she was fine until we got to the courthouse and then she, the walk there, she started to double over. Uh, that was starting to really scare me because we were stuck in a courtroom. But uh, we got out. At least we got a postponement. So there it is. Hello, everybody. So I've been sleeping most of the day, and I'm probably going to go back to sleep here in a little bit. I'm in an awful lot of pain. Um, when I got home from jury duty, which they extended for me because there was no way I was going to be able to sit there in that pain. Um, and they tell you to plan on being there pretty much from 8 to 5. So that's what I planned on. But when I got there, walking to the courthouse, I just started having this god-awful pain in my stomach. So... Um, after they did the whole orientation thing, which took forever, um, I told them what was going on. They gave me an extension. Um, I didn't go to urgent care because they don't do anything for you for kidney stones anyway, basically. 
So I had medicine from the last time I was passing kidney stones, so I just came home and took that, and I've been pretty much sleeping all day, so I haven't done anything on the computer, responding to any comments, and I didn't film anything. So sorry about that, guys. Um, hopefully things will be back to normal tomorrow. Sometimes it can take a couple of days to pass a kidney stone. Um, well, you got to be better by Sunday. If not, I'm going in the wheelchair, and you guys are just going to push me because I am <laughs> going. All right. We have plans on Sunday. Kevin will tell you all about it. So uh, let me have the camera, and you can tell them all about what's going on Sunday. Okay, so this is what we're talking about doing this weekend. It's called Midsummer Scream, and I I have a feeling that it's it's basically Halloween in Ju in July. Basi looks like there's uh, mazes and a whole bunch of um, um, vendors to uh, sort of like a convention um, but uh, it's not calling itself a convention there is actually a convention next weekend that we're going to try and go to so but uh, yeah we're starting our Halloween this weekend we're kicking Halloween off uh, early this year that's right not that we ever really put Halloween away if you can see the skeleton up there and the gathering and yeah we never put Halloween away but so here's all the vendors that are going to be there oh, let me zoom in a little bit it's got I'm not sure high tech haunts which I'm assuming is uh, electronics Vintage and Oddity, The Haunted Store, Bat in Your Belfry, A Corpse Maker. That sounds like fun. We'll definitely have to bring our camera and our business cards because maybe if they have samples of stuff that they'd like us to display at our Halloween party, we might be able to do that and give them our business card. Yeah. yeah. Don't you wag that tail at me. Oh, shut up. Mojo! Mojo! Hey, everybody. It's come to that time of night where we're going to all say good night now. We hope you had a wonderful day. We hope you enjoyed what you saw. If you did, please give us a thumbs up, a share, a comment, a like, all that happy, crappy stuff. And hopefully I'll feel better tomorrow, and we'll see you guys all tomorrow. Adios. Bye, guys.